A recently announced $5 billion settlement cuts into Goldman Sachs' profits for Q4 in the full year of 2015, and Freddie Mac drops its $1.3 billion lawsuit against Deloitte. Ahead on Thursday's News Wrap. As expected, fourth quarter earnings for Goldman Sachs took a huge hit as a result of last week's announcement settlement for $5.1 billion to resolve claims of mortgage-backed security fraud. The investment banking firm's Q4 2015 net earnings totaled $765 million, approximately one-third of $2.17 billion net earnings reported for the prior year quarter. According to the firm's Q4 and full year 2015 earnings statement released Wednesday, Goldman Sachs net earnings for the full year of 2015 were $6 billion, down from nearly $8.5 billion in 2014. Earnings per common share were reported at $12.14 for 2015, having been reduced by $6.53 due to the RMBS settlement. Despite the substantial decline in net earnings and earnings per common share, Goldman Sachs chairman and CEO Lloyd Blankfin characterized the results as, quote, solid, close quote. Freddie Mac has dropped its $1.3 billion lawsuit against Deloitte that accused the accounting firm of negligence regarding the auditing of certain mortgage loans the GSC purchased from now-defunct mortgage lender Taylor Bean & Whitaker. Both parties agreed to dismiss the suit without prejudice. Freddie Mac originally sued Deloitte in September 2014, claiming that Deloitte, which audited Freddie Mac's loans from 2012 to 2009, had spotted red flags in the Taylor Bean loans, which indicated fraud. You can check out these stories on the latest happenings in the industry right here on our site. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again on Friday. Until then, stay with theusnews.com for the most relevant default servicing news.